Nittany Line Roar here, and I'm going to do another raid video. Uh, this time, I found an opponent who has a blue tank and red flanks. And you're going to see this strategy sometimes because what they're hoping I'm going to do is bring two greens, like I have Melendor and Liana, to kill the tank, Richard. But I'm going to run into a problem when I get to Marjana and Guardian Falcon because then the greens aren't strong against them and a lot of my tiles will be weak and he's hoping it just wears me down and kills me. So here's what you do when you run into this strategy. You choose two heroes of the same color as their tank. So their tank is Richard, he's blue. So I'm going to choose, instead of Melendor, I'm going to choose um, another blue. So. Carol and Grimm is who I'm going to choose. Or I could even um, switch out Liana and bring in a Lacey or something like that. In fact, I'm considering doing that. So um, let's take a look here. My cat likes to provide a lot of commentary for videos. What do you think, Basil? Should I do a Lacey instead of Liana? Should we go for it? I'm tempted. Why not? All right, let's just make sure that the tough troops are on the ones with the weaker defense. 647, 673, yep, okay, I got that right. All right. So we're bringing three of the same color hero against the tank. The reason being because this should still be strong against Richard, but it's going to be really strong against Marjana and Guardian Falcon. Now, this is all going to depend on the board and whether we get blue tiles. All right, can we craft this into anything? Um, I'll be able to get one row of blues off. I don't know how much damage that's going to do. Um, we got a few more here, so that's okay. Let's send this one off. Um, looks like we're going to be able to do another row. And one more. All right, let's kill Richard. Not today, Richard. This will also slow down the mana of our two red friends. OK. Now I'm very close to getting Kirill and Grim off, but I have no blue tiles left. Um, I'm basically starting at nothing here. Uh, so I want to try and hit these heroes as little as possible. Um, I want to send things up this gap if I can. I'm just clearing out tiles because I need to, to reset basically and get blue. Ooh, Kirill is dead. Marjana's about to kill somebody too. I'm about to get wrecked here, watch this. All right, at least we got some blues again. Hopefully we can get Bold Tusk off. See, now they're starting over because um, they have low mana. I need to heal a little bit. All right, who to kill? Um, Guardian Falcon's attack is not too high. I'm not sure I'm too afraid of him. Um, I do think I want to kill Marjana and Guardian Jackal because they have high attacks. All right. Let's get to charging blue again. Take out Jackal. Not gonna be able to heal in time, I don't think. Well, um, we can charge Sartana and Grim. Good. Falcon hit the wrong one. I'm gonna hit Falcon with Grim, and then just go after Regard with Sartana. I didn't think that would kill him. 
Um, I probably won't either. Actually, I should have connected the blues, not the purple. All right, well, the damage over time killed him. All right, and that's how you beat the strategy of when they put one color tank in the front and then the flanks that you're weak to behind it. Um, they're banking on people bringing multiples of the color that the flanks um, are going to be strong against. Uh, so, again, what you do with that strategy is you bring the strong color against the flanks because you're still going to be strong against the tank. Thanks for watching.